Students all across Louisiana are heading back to school and they're getting ready with new notebooks and pencils, clothes and backpacks. But what are teachers and administrators doing to get ready for the new school year? Southern Education Desk reporter Sue Lincoln reports it varies from school to school and teacher to teacher. How do teachers get ready for the start of classes? Who better to ask than Louisiana's 2012 Teacher of the Year, April Giddens. I have to put a fresh spin on it. Um, I do not like to be bored, therefore I do not want to bore my students. Giddens, a teacher at Natchitoches Magnet School, is starting her 16th year in the classroom, the majority of which has been spent teaching 6th graders. Giddens believes early preparation is key. That's why she starts preparing for the new year almost immediately after the previous one ends. She says rejuvenating her lesson plans keeps her enthusiasm high, and that resonates with her students. And so each year I think, what can I do different? So I start reading, I start researching, looking on the internet. What are some great ways that I can do this? Something that's different, something that's new, something that's more effective than what I've done before. And so I will seek out those opportunities. One way she's changing things up this year is by having students keep a journal instead of writing the dreaded book report. They're actually going to write a letter to me about what they've read, what they enjoy, what are the characters doing, um, the plot, the theme. They'll include all that in a letter to me. That's something she picked up in class. Not the one she teaches, the one she took recently. This summer I went through a class, the National Writing Project, and did a lot of research and a lot of reading on best practices and what I can do to improve my classroom. And I read this idea and I thought, that's fantastic, I'm going to use that. One of the perks of being named Teacher of the Year is receiving $150 to spend at a teacher supply store. I was very excited walking through the store. I was just picking things off the shelf, <laughs> excited. Nothing will make a teacher more excited than to give them a $150 gift card to a teacher supply store. It was wonderful. Giddens says some of the chores that are part of prepping for a new school year are far less fun, but necessary. Everything we do in the classroom is important. Every action, every word that we say is so important to make sure that we lift the kids up and that we show them, po be a positive role, mo role model for them and show them that learning can be fun as well as effective. For the Southern Education Desk, I'm Sue Lincoln reporting. Well, as Teacher of the Year, April Giddens gets a smart board for her classroom, $5,000 cash and use of a Mercedes SUV for one year. And next year, April will head to the White House to compete with teachers from around the country for the national title. We wish her lots of luck.